We are back. Uh, I guess there was an item I missed last part, part two, and this is part, th part three. Um, we'll be doing uh, Undead Parish in this part, and uh, I'm trying to record the audio as I play, so maybe it's a better result, because uh, I don't like that I have to sync the audio later. Just record everything at the same time. Uh, the problem is I don't have a good microphone, so maybe it will be shitty quality. But uh, I just want to play. That's not intended to be something very high level. Just a casual playthrough. Um, so I missed an item. I guess the item was like down here in this house. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Yes, here it is. A soul of a lost undead. Soul item. Maybe 200 souls, but... I like to grab all items. Or most of them, I don't know. I, I won't be grabbing all items in this playthrough since it's a... Uh, more casual. <coughs> and uh, some things I don't need for this build, but... Let's do... Let's do it. So, uh, can climb up back the star... Climb back up the stairs. The ladder, sorry. Now stairs. <laughs> um, so we, I'm going this way. Uh, I won't be cutting the tail of the drake off. I don't need the drake sword. But if you cut the tail off, you get a weapon. You can snipe it from here with arrows. Is this guy? This guy is actually a bit stronger. Uh, just more souls. There's a guy over here, you can just kill him with spells. Waste of one cast. Here, in this room there are rats. They can poison or toxin you, I don't remember. Just kill them fast with spells. I missed. Just don't want to get poisoned. And there's a third one here. Easy. And then they are all dead. Humanity, nice. I like humanity. Very useful. Um, <coughs> so this is on that parish. This gate is like the bridge where the gate is sit uh, the the Drake is sitting. So could have come this way but I uh, didn't want to risk dying the fire kill this guy would be nice if they drop their swords shield bash back to back um, there's, m there's a guy to the right spear guy oh, missed As long as I fish for bats backstabs, these guys are not hard. Kick him. Yeah, I wish I had a long sword. Would be much faster. So I'm um, pretty much gonna buy a long sword and then uh, upgrade it to magic early on. Two archers. No problem, just wait for them to shoot. And then cast. Yep. Missed. You kill them with backstabs easily. As well. I can lure them, get close to them, make them draw their swords. And then... Backstab. Um, easy. Allure in school, I think you can use this to to 
get the attention of the boar, but let's see what happens if I whoa if I snipe him. I don't want him. I don't want him to fall. Ah. Let's fight here. Don't fall. Oh, he got stuck. He fell. <laughs> now he's dead. Let's see how much spells do to the boar. Just a little bit. I guess I'm gonna snipe him from here. Could use the fire to kill him. No, I, I, I should be saving my spells to the... Oh, he kicks backwards. So let's try to use the fire. Yeah, die. Just make him stand on the fire. He will die. Come, 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 come. And now he's dead. Easy. So this gate, this guy just closed the gate. He won't be going this way. But, um, whoa! The boy dropped the helm. It's actually, I won't be using it, but it's actually quite nice helm with fangs. Um. Here, in this tower, we have a black knight. We can backstab him, kill him with backstabs, or use the fire. I'm gonna use the fire. So, follow me. Just get his attention. Mm. Whoa, it's, it's quick. Come on, follow me, follow me, follow me. I'm here. So you can basically stand here and wait for the fire to when he attacks. It's not a very intelligent AI. See? It's almost dead. And just hug the wall, the fire won't hit you, won't, won't damage you. And now he's dead. Ah, easy. The shield again, I have two shields. Like the drops are not so common, but two shields. Would be nice to have like a, a weapon. This guy is actually a trap, he will run. The game expects you to run after him. And there's one guy waiting here. I guess and the other one there. Whoops. Now they're both dead. Um Kill this guy. Another one. So I wish I had a long sword. Um, let's see. An item. Stable. A mystery key. <coughs> Holy shit. Yeah, these guys actually hit a bit hard. If we're not careful, you could easily die. Um, just walk down this plank. 
large soul come back more ladders um let's see fog gate yeah And we're back outside. Uh, see, there's an annoying spear guy here. Like, just kick him. Oh, no need to kick him. <laughs> Actually, I missed the kick and <laughs> was exactly when he was attacking. No Estus, no heal. Uh, there's a to the right. There's a spear guy, I guess, and to the left a Balder Balder Knight. What they call Balder Knights. This is spells on him. Yep, yeah, dead. Oops. Oh, again, I'm missing the kicks. But we got a back step. Mm. I just wanted to kick him <laughs> like this. Mm. Let's kill this guy here. Actually, I think we could... And now he's dead. No, not dead. No, don't heal! Dead. Uh, this is, a, I think, a shield. Yeah, a night shield. But uh, I won't be using another shield. Not until later, very late in the game. I like to use the heater shield, the, the one I have. Very good shield. Light, 100% physical block, and um, cheap, easily available. Uh, you just have to buy it from the undead merchant. Very good shield. Now, um, just gonna kill these guys with backstabs. Longsword, yeah. Nice. So I want to I won't have to buy one. Let's equip it. Proper heal. Let's see. Long sword. Yep. Nice. Oh, someone sign. These days few people play the game. Maybe it's the coronavirus pandemic and so more people are playing it. But uh yeah, let me just grab the bonfire here real quick. Um, <coughs> uh, I think I'm gonna go ahead and kindle. Let's not waste the energy we have. Nice. Before I level up, let's see if the blacksmith was selling anything I want. Uh, Andre. Well, you must be a new arrival. I'm Andre of a store rat. If you require smithing, then speak to me. Let's repair our equipment. Not that I need it, but. Uh, Learn the gesture. Let's see what he's selling. Tight night shards. Um, see, the repair box is nice, but I won't buy it now. Yeah, the longsword. 
I already have it. Actually, I'm gonna reinforce my longsword into a longsword plus one. Uh, Don't let's get yourself killed. Neither. Let's see. Um, let's use these items. Let's see, I think I'll reinforce the sword well, again. Um, I need one Titanite shot, so I'm going to buy it. So there's 800 souls. Oops. Reinforced weapon. Yes. Now I've got a plus two longsword. Let's level up a little bit. Um, let's see. Two levels. Let's see. One and one. Yes. Actually, let's explore. Finish exploring the map. I think I'm gonna explore the map. Then uh, maybe take the sword to plus plus five, so I can have a magic long sword. Yeah, probably will do that. Let's just explore everything in this. On that parish. Uh, you see the dagger had like good critical hits. But it hit like 10. This this sword is hitting like for for like uh, 120 a backstab. It's less than the dagger. I don't know, I don't remember maybe. Less maybe it's more, I don't know, but it's not very different from the dagger, from what we're doing with the dagger, but the uh, normal hits are hitting for more damage. So this guy, come on, follow me. I don't know, I prefer to fight him outside. Yep. You can just spam him with spells when his shield is, is down, when he's attacking, like now. Yep, decent damage. Don't heal, don't heal, die, yes. Titanite shot, yes. Nice. Got closer to a plus five long sword. Um, Firekeeper soul. <coughs> Let's see. I'm gonna just use the short, activate the shortcut. The shortcut. Goes back to Firelink Shrine. Since I'm in the shortcut, let let me grab an item, then I come back. It's a secret. You just roll here, uh, and then uh, to that platform, to that. Yep. Um. This is the nest of the crawl that took us here. Um, we can use it to go back to Undead Asylum. But first, let's uh, grab this item. Yeah, we need this key to get that ring I told you in the first part. Um, but I'll be doing this a little bit later because uh, in order to get a magic longsword, we need to go to Blight Town. And in Blight Town, uh, that ring will be very useful. Um, so basically, like town poisonous swamp, and it kind of slows down your movement, hinders you a little bit. So with, with that ring, you can walk normally. Oh, and I remember now. I forgot to grab a ring that was behind that black knight, that first black knight. Maybe I'll grab it later, but it's not very useful. Um. All right, now what should we do now? Yes, let's uh, kill the Balder Knights here. Oh, forgot about the Chandler. Yeah, it's quite hard. Just 
spawn the spells. You can backstab them. They're not hard to kill. Just have to be careful this one because he can parry you. He has like a parry stance. <coughs> Just fishing for backstabs. Easy. Yeah, we could kill the Chandler now. Let's grab some items first. Uh, here we have Halberd. Kill this guy. Yep. Basement key. Yes. We're gonna use it to access another area. This basement key. The I forgot how, how the area is called. Um, lower on that bug, I guess. I don't remember. Mm. Alright, now there's a Balder Knight there. Yeah, in your face. In your face again. In your face, not so much. Now. Yeah, I need to be careful because I'll be swarmed by a lot of those undead guys. So this block back. Oh no, the Chandler followed. It. Oh, he's gonna be casting. Whoops. Yeah, they, they are buffed. See this blue whale aura? I think th it gives them more attack, more HP. Oops. See how hard they hit. Heal again. Kill them. Now the Chandler. Let's see how I'm gonna kill him. Just yeah, dead. Would be nice that if he dropped his his weapon, but uh, it's quite a rare drop. I think it's one percent or something like that. So it's rare, rare drop. Yeah, I think it's one percent chance. With the zero humanity, let's see. Not a soul item. Useful. Uh, here, this is the way to the boss. Yeah, I guess we could fight the boss now, but not. Let's do other stuff. Alright, uh, there's another. Balder Knight. Uh, let's use spells. Yep. Oh, did he drop something? Nope. Um. Can break this. But before I go inside, I think there's an item here. Yeah. Every time you see a body inside a barrel like this, you break the barrel and the when the body falls. Maybe. I think every time you see this. That would be an item. And now we find Lotrek. Oh, then I am in luck. Could you help me? As you can see, I am stuck without recourse. Yeah, I'm gonna help him, but I'm gonna kill him. But not now, later. Thank you. Yes, sincerely. I am Knight Lautrec of Karim. I truly appreciate this. <coughs> and I guarantee a reward. Only later. Alright, a reward. Yes, very sorry. Your reward will have to wait. I have just been freed. Allow me some time. My reward will be his ring? I am free. 
He wears a very nice ring. I can get back to work. <laughs> and uh I am free. Let's see. Yeah. Now. I've exhausted his right. dialogue. <laughs> If you don't kill him before a certain point of the game, I guess he, I think he kills the firekeeper from Firelink Shrine. You can revive her, but uh, you lose the bonfire for quite while, quite a while. And it's I think it's a very useful bonfire from fire, fire, the the one from Firelink Shrine, especially early in the games, like a central hub. Mm, yeah, nothing here. All right. Let's see what should I do next. Uh, yeah, I should. I forgot to talk to to Sig Sigmaya. Sigmaya of Katarina. Um, yeah, we're pretty, mu pretty much done with this map. Just need to kill the boss. But uh, before I kill the boss, I need. I want to have a magic weapon. So I'm gonna go ahead and uh, stop this. I think I'm gonna stop the recording for a little bit here, or maybe I'll stop the recording and show just uh, show you how to get a magic weapon and then farm off camera because uh, it's well, tedious uh, to farm. Let's see, Prepare everything. Um, Reinfo uh, reinforce weapon. So I need one more Titanite charge. All right. Um. Long sword plus plus three. Two more. Let's make it plus four. Okay. Don't get yourself. No. Well, maybe I should first uh, grab some spells. Yeah, I could do. I could free. Uh, I forgot the name of the NPC, but there's an NPC you can free that sells you sorceries. So maybe I should free him first. Let's see. Let's talk to. Our mm. friend. Hmm. 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 Oh, forgive me. I was absorbed in thought. I am Ziegmeier of Katarina. Ziegmeier. I've run flat up against a wall, or a gate, I should say. The thing just won't budge, no matter how long I wait. And oh, <laughs> have I waited? So here I sit. Quite a pickle, weighing my options, so to speak. <laughs> Still closed. Still closed. Mm. Still closed. Still closed. Yeah. Mm. Exhausted, exhausted his dialogue, so we need to, to, in order to open this gate, to so we'll stay here until the gate is opened, we need to ring the two bells of awakening. Until we do so, uh, We'll stay there. Let's see. Um, yeah, I guess I'll show you how to, to go back to <coughs> Undead Asylum. And we gr just go we we'll just go there to grab a ring and then come back. Let's see. Shortcut. That's where we want to go. Drop down here. <coughs> and 
go up those stairs. And then we f have an option to curl up like a ball. It takes like 20 or 30 seconds the first, I don't know, maybe 20 seconds the first time you do it. But once you, once you do it, if you do it at least once, uh, then it's almost instantaneously, instantaneous. Just this first time, it takes a long time. As long as you just don't stand up. guys also can be quite deadly if we're not careful see I died nice <laughs> I should have rested at Firelink Shrine now I have to walk that all that again Ah, uh, let's try to do it quick. Just rush it, just rush there. Just rush there, ignore the enemies. And let's do it again. I won't rest in firing train because like was not so far uh, as I thought. Let's see. Yeah, immediately. I'll skip this cutscene. Yep. There my souls are. Try to snipe him. them with spells just to be sure kill them let's kill them yep let's see good job go straight ahead huh don't go straight ahead don't don't step in the middle of the arena Let's kill these guys. <coughs> Dead. Now. Remember the guy that gave us the Estus flask? He's alive. Or I should say dead. Undead. He's hollow. It will be, I guess, there. I don't remember where he is. I'll go up there first, grab the ring, then I... Oh, I forgot about the boulder. <laughs> Let's go this way first. Grab the ring. So we don't risk dying. Um... Oh, he's stuck. Oops. I 
have to watch out for these combos. Was just one guy now, there are two. They have more HP. Let's kill this one with spells. And then we kill the second one. Oh, this is Peer guy. I thought it was He's trying to heal, I won't let him heal. A long sword again. Never am that lucky with long swords. <laughs> now, what we came here for the rusted iron ring. Let's see. Yeah, since we're here, let's kill Oscar. He'll give us a f some souls. Yeah, there he is. Good thing he's slow. But he would usually dodge the spells. Thank you, him here. Fat rolling, shouldn't be fat rolling. We can heal. Backstab. Nice. Yeah, he's a pus. Yeah, that's one of the problems of the long sword. Small spaces. Let's see if we hit him. Nope. Last spell. And then I kill him with a backstab. Yep. He will drop his shield, I guess. Yeah, press shield. Now just let's go back to Firelink Shrine. <coughs> Do not step in the middle of the arena. Because I don't know if you remember the demon that was below it. If you step like around there in the middle, the floor will crumble and you will be fighting a... you'll be in a boss fight and it's not very easy to kill him at this level he's a relatively tough... he's a relatively tough boss uh, let's go back let's keep the cutscenes yep um, let's see this I'm just gonna drop down here any any way I can. Yep. Oh, nice. One level, just one. Well, let's put it in intelligence. Increase our magic a little bit. Uh, also, we had a. Uh, Firekeeper soul. Oh, there's there's no track. Let's reinforce Astus flask. Um, ah, hello let's talk to him. I have your reward. Please accept it. I am grateful to you for freeing me. <laughs> <laughs> Not enough for you. 
Well, let's not be greedy now. <laughs> By the Lord, <laughs> your face, <laughs> your humanity is really slipping, but there are methods. Most fools have more humanity than they know what to do with. Now, who do you imagine will make the best use of it? <coughs> mm -hmm. hmm. Our futures are murky. Let's see, let's kill him now. Let's kill him now. Just kick him and him. Well, Oh. Are we here? No, I wanna kick. Are you sure about this? Yeah, I wanna kick. Oh, he won't fall. He won't fall. Yeah, now yes. Now he's dead. So just quit and reload. Uh Let's see. Okay. Continue. And we have five humanity and the ring of favor and protection. It's actually one of the best rings in the game. Uh, but it breaks if you ever remove him, remove it. So I'm gonna be using it for the whole playthrough. Play through. It increases like your HP, stamina, and equip load by 20%, which is a lot. So uh, I'm gonna go down here. Let's see. Take this elevator. of a nameless soldier. Yes, I could do a suicide run to get another soul for fire keeper, but won't do so now. Uh, you can find here the magic blacksmith, but I'll talk to him later. Once I have the items I need to make my magic longsword. But I'll still have to make it uh, plus five. So let's see. That's the reason why I grab the master key <coughs> to access this area earlier. Okay, um, let's see if I can get to the bonfire of Light Town without dying. Let's, see, let's, see. let's try it. Yeah, almost hit me. So just have to... It's very easy to see the ladders because there's always a torch. So just follow the torches, you see the ladders. Just want to go down as fast as possible. Oh, not here. Yep. And I also want to avoid toxic. There are guys that can flick toxic on you around here. Oh, the enemy is following me. <laughs> yeah, the guy that can flick toxic. Shooting these darts. To toxics. Very. Can kill you very fast. This is status that can kill you very fast. Now, I'm just gonna fall on one of these platforms. Yeah. And write it down. Jump off. Yeah, we just arrived at Light Town. Um, I, I've equipped the rusted iron ring so I can move at normal speed on the swamp. See? So, yeah, quick trip to the bonfire. Yes. There's a chest. 
in this area here. I think it's a dragon scale. Yeah, we'll be needing dragon scales because uh, I'm gonna use it. Gonna be using the moonlight great sword. So for this build, so we need dragons. Ten dragon scales to make it to fully upgrade it. So uh, I think I'm gonna end this part here because probably it's pretty long, like 40 minutes or more. I don't know. I'm not uh, really controlling the time. Let's see. I won't level up because uh, actually that let me just show you how to farm you just want to go t this way to the left yeah I won't even bother to get poisoned I'll go this way to the left we want to kill these leeches but uh, first I'm gonna go up this tree branch here, or tree root. No, no. There's an item. And this is... Luxury wall. Chest. Between humanities. And another fake wall. Just gonna grab this bonfire in case I die. There's a bonfire here, and I don't have to walk a lot. All right, I'm gonna rest. Get rid of poison. Usually, if this was a melee character like strength or dex, I'll be getting the chloranthi ring. That's that item right there but I won't be needing this for this ring for this build so I'm gonna end this part here and actually not end let me show you how to just to farm how you farm the we need green titanite shards 10 of them to make a plus 5 magic weapon so we are overpowered early and actually we can make use of uh, putting uh, most of our stats into intelligence. So uh, we'll translate to more damage, more physical damage. Basically, you want the red drop from these leeches. They drop five titanite, green titanite shards, the red drop. Uh, try not to miss like they did. He'll drop five. So you need to we need two rare drops from them. Make them drop twice. Oh. So don't miss the spells. Yeah, they're not so super hard to kill, I just playing careful. If we kill them. Yeah, they also drop titanite charge, like titanite charge, but I want the rare drop. Uh, basically, we just do this until we drop two red drops. So I'm gonna go ahead and do this off camera, and once I return next episode, uh, I already have them. So see you.